What's up everybody, TaxProduction7 here, back with the Minecraft mod tutorial. Today's mod tutorial will be on the Advanced Hood mod, and what this mod does is it allows you to reposition and change the look of the, um, the stuff on your Minecraft HUD. So let me go ahead and jump in my world here, and I will show you how to use this mod. So when you're in your world, if you hit H, it'll bring up the Advanced HUD mod uh, settings menu. And you can see we have all of the stuff here, your health bar, hunger, armor, crosshair, XP, chat, item, and all, all the other good stuff here. So if we go ahead and open this up, we can reposition it. So I can reposition my health bar to put it wherever I want, say I want it at the top of the screen or something. But um, I'm going to go ahead and just try to stack it right here. You can also change the style of it, so now you can see it's double the hearts. Or it could be a solid bar or a smaller solid bar. I'll just keep it at double. Um, the fade speed, I'm not sure what the fade is supposed to be. So I'm sorry I can't really sh uh, show you what that is. Then the hunger bar, of course, you can move everything around wherever you want it to be. And again, there's the same style of um, double, big bar, or small bar. Then the item bar, you can either make this horizontal or keep it at vertical. Or, no, make it horizontal. Make it vertical and keep it at horizontal. And again, you can reposition this as well. So I'm just going to kind of toss stuff around here just to quickly show you stuff. Um, I don't have any level right now, so I can't, you can't see the level counter. So that's pretty much how you use it. Then if you go to global settings, you can enable and disable elements. So you can turn your health bar on or off. So this would be cool to use, say, if you're going to do some sort of um, mach uh, machinima thing and you want only certain things to be off your screen and not all of it. Uh, you can change the binding key, and what this is is, is um, the key you use to open up the advanced HUD settings. And if you click on this, it says press push button now. Uh, you can right now it's binded to H. Say I want to open it with U. Now it'll say U, so I'll use U to open up the um, settings. And then if you go to preset manager, how I have it right now, I can go ahead and save that and just do save current and name it I don't know just blah and save so now I'll be able to load blah whenever I um, need it so I just click on blah there you go you see it goes back so that is pretty much the advanced HUD mod so I now need to clean out my Minecraft jar after I do that I'll be back and I'll show you how to install this mod Okay, so what you need to install this mod is some sort of archiving program such as WinRAR, 7-Zip, or WinZip. All these programs work the same way, so you can use whatever you prefer. I'll be using WinRAR in this tutorial. Then the only thing you need to download is the Advanced HUD mod itself. So to get that mod, if I go ahead and give you a link to this page in the description, you go ahead and scroll down. This mod will tell you all this mod. This page will tell you all the information about the mod that you need to know. There's a couple screenshots, but you want to come down to the download section and go ahead and click on the download link right here. And this will take us over to an ad fly. And then it'll say, please wait five seconds up in the top right hand corner. After that five seconds is up, a yellow button saying skip ad will appear. As soon as you click on skip ad, it will automatically download the mod. So that is how to download the mod. And when you're, when you're ready to install it, go ahead and come over to start. Then type in percent app data percent. Just like this down here in the bottom left hand corner. Then go ahead and open up your roaming. Then open your dot minecraft. Open your bin left click your minecraft jar then right click it and do open with and select whatever archiving program you are using I'm using WinRAR so I'm going to go ahead and open it with WinRAR now your bin you're not going to need anymore so you go ahead and just close that so once you have your minecraft jar open go ahead and open up the advanced HUD mod highlight these three files and drag them into your minecraft jar and hit OK go ahead and close the mod now in your Minecraft jar, you should see a folder called MetaInf. If you do not see this folder, it's okay. You can go ahead and just skip this step. But if you do see it, what you want to do is delete it. So go ahead and left click it, then right click it. 
select delete files then hit yes and that will delete meta inf you want to make sure you always delete meta inf when you're installing a mod to minecraft if you don't it'll make minecraft crash so after you delete meta inf you go ahead and close your minecraft jar and that is it a very simple installation for this mod so i hope this video helped you guys out thank you for watching and i'll see you guys next time